YouTube. What is the deal, YouTube? Chess and Mr. Hamilton is the name. Right now, y'all looking at the money right there, man. Refineries, baby. Plants everywhere. Everywhere you look, man. Everywhere you look in the great state of Texas. Where I work, refineries everywhere. Chasing Mr. Hamilton is the name, trucking is the game. My wallet to guess wall is the goal with the heart of a lion mentality of a hyena. Steady rolling wide cause we don't get time, we get money. And that's a fact. I put my name on it. So what is, what's happening today, you too? I believe today is Friday. What's happening this fine Friday where I'm not going out of state today. I'm doing a little local run, you know. I'm gonna probably turn that into a six, eight hours. Maybe go home a little bit early. Um, so your boy get paid by the hour. So I did my reset from Tuesday to Wednesday. No, I did my reset on Wednesday. And then since it's the 34, that transition to me coming in at 6 a.m. today. But, you know, I've already put in about 28 hours already. My pay is from Sunday to Sunday. My pay week is Sunday to Sunday. So, I got Friday, Saturday, Sunday to make some money. You know, after the day, I'll be well over late 30s. And then I'm definitely working Saturday on Sunday, so they probably send me out of state. Or if I do another local run, it don't matter. As long as I break 50 hours, I'm good. Because what I get paid, anything over 50 is, is enough to uh, to put some of you over the road truckers to shame. That's all I got to say. So uh, no worries here. How's your weather, man? I hope the weather's holding up over there, because right here, yesterday was crazy. It was crazy yesterday. I mean, it was around 2 o'clock, and it was already foggy. I mean, I'm talking about some midnight, 2, 3 a.m. foggy at 2 p.m. over here. I don't know what that was yesterday. It's still a little bit foggy over here, as you can see, so... Uh, Man, this light taking forever. But it's not as bad today. I gotta go over. Usually whenever I go certain routes, I have to bust a clean U-turn. And that usually above me going under this thing, regardless of how scary it is. And um, here we go. Notice we're bought in some new cats, new hire. It's, it looks like I got I got to the office this morning, the lunch room. You know, there was some new boys sitting down over there. I guess they're waiting for that paperwork. They're waiting to get that sign their lap away. They, they're waiting to get on the journey to the money. So there ain't nothing wrong with that, man. There's nothing wrong with that. I finally did my taxes. Like you drivers out there, man, y'all gotta hop on the taxis because I was told you got to like April, April something rather, before uh, you can't do it no more. Man, don't let Uncle say I'm just walking away with your money. Well, I guess technically you can do it, but you have to pay late fees or something. I don't know. I'm not much into the whole tax thing. But this year I finally filed one with a professional rather than just going to a... Uh, going to my dad's house and hopping on turbo tax and click yes yes no no and bam and ended up with 1200 bucks that's what i always got is 1200 dollars you know what i mean i'm like damn 
every freaking year. $1,200 every year. So I'm like, man, I'm getting tired of this shit. So, there we go. So I went to a professional. She charged me about 300 and something bucks. I don't care. She got me like doubled, I guess. I was supposed to be getting me double what I usually get. 1200 bucks. So I can at least expect $2,400 back. You know what I mean? But hopefully she's going to get more than that. But I can at least expect that. So I, I ain't, I'm not complaining too much. So I'm a man, damn it. You know what I mean? watch a video the other day right there's a channel right on YouTube I watch other truckers right and there's this chick I don't want to mention no name I'm not trying to give no free promotion or nothing but some of y'all know who she is by now I mean she'll be blogging like maybe two weeks I don't know maybe a month or two right when she first came in the scene or whatever I checked her out this girl had like four or five hundred views on all her channel, right? It was like nothing huge. And then she got on a, on a, another another chat another guy's channel, right? And I guess he was he's thing is to interview truckers or whatever, blah blah blah. But I know exactly why he interviewed this specific chick. I just got in truck. Look, all I gotta say, she don't look like a trucker, right? Like, she look like one of them girls that belong in the office, doing nails, and she talk like it, right? But hey, I give her prompts. Once again, y'all gotta mess with Swift when you come in in this business for all the new truckers. When you new, you gotta mess with Swift, cause Swift is big enough to take risk on you, man. No other trucking company can afford that. Swift don't care, they're a billion, com billion dollar company. Did they take risk on anybody? So, anyways, from two weeks ago, all her videos were like four or five hundred views. And then once she got in this on this boy's channel, right? He did a little interview via Skype or FaceTime or whatever. And then, bro, when you I don't know, I'm not gonna tell you who it is, but when y'all find out, you will know what I'm talking about. So the interview, like she blew up like crazy, literally overnight. Now, I checked yesterday on her channel after seeing the interview, her stuff for like 7,000 views. She went from like 200 subscribers to like, like 1,300 subscribers overnight because people are following people for the wrong reason on YouTube. Yeah, she fine. Yeah, she got big old boobs or whatever. That's what everybody was talking about. They didn't care about what she was saying. Nobody was paying attention to that. They were just listening on how fine she is. And, what they would like to do to her and stuff like that and big old titties and all that you know what i mean so i guess that's what it come to man but yeah she, she a new trucker from swift i guess technically this would be a free promotion but whatever it is what it is but what, what i'm saying is guys you need to follow channels that are going to give you relevant information you know when it comes to this blogging community it's a little bit hard i understand you know it's a little bit hard Eventually, you know, don't follow a girl because she got big titties, okay? Or don't follow a man because he's fine, no homo. If you're a female, you know, whatever your reason is, just follow them because they can give you good advice and resources and they're actually sharing relevant, whether it be their life, they're sharing their life with you or they're doing whatever, right? Like, I, for me, it's hard to think that somebody who has not been trucking for at least over a year can really give you any relevant advice. Yeah, yeah, that sounds like hate. I know. It is what it is. I'll leave it right there. As a new trucker, don't get your info from a new trucker. That's the point. If you're a broke man, you're broke as hell, and you want to be a millionaire, why would you take business advice or investment advice from somebody who's just as broke as you? So what you want to do, my advice would be, you know, like follow people that be doing this for a couple years, two, three, four, five years, you know, that uh, 
giving you insights of what's going on around the, around the, the trucking industry right now. What's going on in their life and stuff like that. Someone that keep it 100 with you now. She, she, she's an eye candy, I guess, if that's what you're looking for. By all means, man, you're going to find her. I don't have to tell you who she is. You're going to find her if you're looking for eye candy. So that's for sure. But uh, anyways, man, we're over here on this bridge right now. I'm uh, I'm gonna stop, you know, talking. Let you handle your business. For all the people, all my subscribers, all 1,300 of y'all, I appreciate y'all, man. Y'all be holding it down for a brother. I appreciate that. Look, I'm gonna try to switch this thing up a little bit. You know, I'm gonna try to bring some funny content, you know, content in also, like maybe be pranks, something for entertainment. But my only thing is, I roll so much, man. I, I don't really have a lot of home time. And then when I do have some home time, I'm uh, I be sipping on that Jamaican whiskey. You know what I mean? Or that Jamaican rum. Or just having a movie day. But my main problem is I haven't been able to find a secondary camera, man. You know, I do have an actual camera in my house instead of just my phone. I, I, I'm gonna start doing, you know, no skit necessary, but I'm gonna start mixing this thing up, bringing some entertainment. I did a little something with that dollar poop going on, but that one was uh, it was too long and my computer got fried and uh, yeah, so I need something I can do on the phone, on the go, like skits and stuff like that. But yeah, I'm a definitely man. I definitely got y'all. I appreciate you staying true, man. Hi right, YouTube, happy Mo Friday. Y'all enjoy, man. Y'all stay the road and get this money, you know. I mean, that's the only thing we're here for, right? The only thing we're trucking for is to get some money so you can take care of yours, your household, keep a roof over your family, or just get some money if you ain't got no family. Just get some money and do it wisely, man. Don't go out there breaking your backs for these companies that don't want to pay you. You see, I know. I say that every day long at the end of every video, but it's facts, man. It's facts. You don't see a heart, a heart surgeon in out there doing free heart operation except by choice, right? Do you see them doing that? The answer is no. They're getting paid, man. Uh, you don't see a, a lawyer representing you free all the time except if they're pro bono or they're doing it for the publicity to get their stocks out. No, you're paying for what they do. So you get paid for what you do, man. That's all I'm saying. I'm a stay blessed. Chasing Mr. Hamilton, I'm out.